Hi everyone and welcome back to The Maths Man. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to add multiple numbers together as quickly as possible and as accurately as possible. Let's get right into it. You have no idea how many times I have asked students in year six to add more than five numbers together, two digit numbers, maybe three digit numbers, and every single time they get it wrong. And what I'd like you to do is pause the video now. I want you to try and add these numbers up, okay? And I want you to time yourself to see how long it takes you. And then I want you to write down the answer and keep it to the side. Then what I want you to do is watch the way I'm going to show you how to do it. And then I want you to time yourself again and see if you get a quicker time and let's see if you also get the right answer as well. Now, if you did pause the video and you tried to work this out by going 74 plus 68 plus 98 and doing a huge massive column method, then I'm here to tell you that that is not the easiest way to do it. Okay, because there's loads of mistakes that can be made doing that. Instead of using the formal written method, I'm going to use my number bonds. And yes, I am talking about the number bonds that you learnt about in FS1 and FS2. Let me show you how I'm going to do it. So first, I'm going to go through all these numbers and I'm going to highlight all the numbers that are in the tens column. So here I have 70, 60, 90, 10, 30, 40 and 70. Then I'm going to try and find number bonds. So there's a seven and there's a three. 70 and 30 makes 100, so I put one down. 90 and 10 make another 100, there's 200. 40 and 60, there's another 100, there's 300. And then I've got 70 on its own, so instead of a tally, I'm gonna change it to 300. And then I've got a 70 as well. Now I'm going to do the same, but this time I'm going to do it with the units. Five and five, that makes a 10. Eight and two, that makes a 10. Eight and two again, that makes another 10. So I've got 30 so far. And then I've got one four on its own. Okay, so I'm going to change this into 30. So now, how much easier is it to add 300, 70, 30, and four together? Well, look, 30 and 70 makes 100. So I've got 300 plus 100 makes 400. And then I've just got my four here, plus four. And the answer was 404. I've now written seven brand new numbers on my whiteboard and what I'd like you to do is pause the video again and I'd like you to add these seven numbers up using the technique that I showed you earlier in this video and what I'd like you to do is time yourself again and I'd like to see if one you got the correct answer and two did you get the correct answer much quicker than you did before. I hope this video has been helpful and you did learn something. If you did then please hit that like button down below and consider hitting the subscribe button if you'd like to see more Key Stage 2 videos. All the best.